Here's your host, Captain Vernon. Holy moly! We got some good light in here. We're actually getting to, to be a little bit more of a professional setup. Wow! Well, thank you for being here, and thank you for part one of our uh, multi-part Rusty Rivets review. Oh my goodness! We're gonna do some unboxing right now. We're gonna unbox them, see what they have in there. So, um, hands. We're gonna take over. We're gonna make this happen because this is gonna happen, Captain. <laughs> that's funny. That's I am a captain. I'm gonna make it happen. Really? That's really good, clever stuff. It's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. So let's um go. We're going to have Hans McHansington come in here, talk a little bit about the toys you see here. It's too many to do in one review. So we're going to spread it over a couple of, couple of um, what are these things called? Videos. Yes, a couple of videos. And then um, we'll just keep coming back and doing our thing. So let's take it away. Hans, what's the first toy we have today? Well, we talked about this yesterday, or whenever we made this last tape. Uh, we have these little go-karts. So uh, there are actually four of them that are out. You have the one, the only, Bodasaur! Again, a very terrible, terrible dinosaur impression. Yeah, 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 whatever. Then we have, um, who is this? This is all. <laughs> this is Ruby. Technology gets me really amped up. That's amazing, Ruby. With my super cool tools and high-tech helpers, I can put any plan in motion. Who is red like a ruby. Whoa, fell down. Holy moly. Yes, yes, that's very cool. I like that. It comes in her little go-kart. It's red with some blue highlights on it. And she has her helmet on because you always have safety first. Safety first whenever you're in cars, especially go-karts like these. Then we have the adorable Liam. We don't want you getting into any trouble. What? When was the last time I got into trouble? Oh, wait. Okay, I'll be good. He's got his little blue helmet on. Mm, yes, yes, the helmets are nice. They're a nice touch. Because if, if you're going to be in a go-kart of some sort, you really need to wear your helmet. Why is that? Well, <laughs> it keeps you safe. That makes sense. Oh, yes, of course that makes sense. Well, let's keep going. Keep going, man. Keep going. And last but not least, you have the man with the plan, the head guy, you have Rusty. Yes! That's it! Great job, team. Rusty, my good buddy. Look at us. We look so good together. Look. Oh. So, um, what else do we have? What else do we have to see today? And then we also have these two very amazing builds. So, the whole point of the Rusty Rivet system is that they have a Build Me Rivet system. The Build Me Rivet system is a collection of Rusty Rivets toys you can customize, modify, and rustify. That's right. And essentially what they do is they have these diagrams on the side. Oh, God, come on, man. Come on get, get, get over there. So you can see exactly how you're supposed to build something. And then on the back, why'd you leave the picture? I don't, do they want to see me on camera? I think they do. You're the talent. Oh, right, right. I'll, I'll get on camera. Sorry. So, well, on camera. There you go. And then we also have uh, the easy build system so that you can see exactly how to put it together. And, um, you know, it just goes together nicely. And you have a lot of different configurations. Oh, you can make it a, a some kind of car. You can make it a car tank. A, was that a tank car? Is, is that what it's called? You just made up the word, so I don't know. Whatever, whatever. So, what else? What else? And then it says, combine it and design it, which is the tagline of the show. And it says, collect them all. Well, we were lucky enough to collect them all. We have all those toys in the back. Are we going to get to review those as well? That's the hope. Well, we got to get moving if we're going to review all of them. It's going to take a while to get through all these toys and open them and then look at them and play with them. But let's get to it, man. Let's get to it. Then they get to the next toy and then we'll open them up. Oh, fine. You're getting really, really antsy. <laughs> these are cool toys. Look at them. I mean, you, you build it. You create it. It's, it's, it's very clever. It's very cool. So anyway, let's get to the rest of the toys. What's the other, what's the other toy that we have that we're going to look at? Yes. So we also have... Woo! Whoa, come watch it! Watch the camera! <laughs> you almost destroyed the whole production! Sorry, sorry. Yes, be sorry. You'll be sorry! Look at the look at the toy. Oh, sorry, sorry. So, and then we also have another another build, which is called a buggy build, and this is Ruby's. Ruby has her own build. So what is it? Uh, why are my lips moving? 
<laughs> right, right, right. Oh, now I'm talking about you. Oh, this is weird. So, what's the next toy? Well, you have the buggy build here, which is for Ruby. That's Ruby. Ruby's, oh, he's, she's a good friend of Rusty. They're always doing all kinds of cool adventures and making cool toys. I agree. So, this particular build is much like the other um, buggy that you see that's her little racer. So these actually are just mini versions of, um, these are actually larger versions of the other toys that you see. So let's do a quick count of the toys that we have today, okay? We have Rusty Rivets. Um, the cart build is one. The buggy build is two. And then Bodasaur is three. You have another Ruby is four. You have Liam is five and Rusty is six. So today we have six toys that we're gonna open and play with and see how they work. Well, I like the sound of that. Roll the music! These are very cool. So what does this thing do? What is what is what does this thing do? Are you carrying that with your hook? Yes. <laughs> How else am I supposed to carry it? My other hand doesn't really work. Yes. Um, um, we'll get to the toys. Just put it down. I'm not done yet. Fine, fine, fine. Just, just hurry up, man. Hurry up. <laughs> close I'm zooming in so you can see the toys so get out of the shot oh fine I fine, find them I'll move out all right so these are just kind of the mini cart racers they um they don't pull back or anything but they do look great very colorful lots of bright colors as always rusty uh, has his trademark symbol on his chest and he's kind of a neon orange color with his cool little helmet and his goggles. The goggles don't come down or anything. Um, he does turn a little bit, but not enough that um, I would <laughs> do it because it might actually break. But these are, just looks really nice. They're very colorful, very bright. Uh, Liam has a similar cart. Oh, not similar. It's actually, this is only a three-wheeler. It's more like a um, power wheel, those old school power wheels. Do they still make those? I don't know, man. I never rode a bike. Really? You've never ridden a bike? I've got a pig leg. How can I? You're right. You're right. Sorry. So, anyway, he's got his safety helmet on, which is a bright blue color. And again, he has some, it's more of a teal, kind of an aqua color. And the three wheels, the two wheels in the back, they spin. The front wheel does not, but it does have a little mini wheel right there. Next. You've got Ruby. She's looking very cool, very sporty. Has her helmet on with the goggles. Again, the goggles don't turn and she only moves slightly so I wouldn't turn it too much because they might just snap off. Little engine in the back. Again, four. this one has four wheels. All of them spin. It makes for some great racing. And last but not least, you have Bodasaur, who is green. Now his helmet, his um, mouth doesn't open. He does have these treads, but the treads don't spin, but it has four little wheels on it so that you can uh, roll him along with the other racers. Okay? Why don't we do a quick race? Fine, fine, fine. Okay. Let's do a quick race. But they li line them up. Line them up. Line, line. All right. They're too, they're too close. They're too close. All right. That's one. Two. Oh, boy. Three. And here comes Ruby. Oh, Liam's backing up. Oh, whoa. Backup feature. I think it's just the angle, yep. Oh, oh, look at that. It looks like Bodasaur is the winner of this particular race. Bodasaur is the winner, so what's his prize? Um, he gets to be played with again? All right, I guess that's a good prize. All right, so these are the racers. They're very nice. Again, no pullback feature, but they do roll nicely on any surface. All right, all right, what's next? Well, we have 
Rusty's cart build. All right, so here are all the parts that it came with. It comes with the frame of the car, which again, just greatly designed. Looks like it's perfect for a little character to fit into. Whoop, and stop. And cut the nice little engine part. Now, it's a car, so it has four wheels, which pop on and off very easily. I'll just show them all on screen. One wheel. Two. Three. And four. Now, it's important to know that they are two different size wheels, so you have a larger wheel and a slightly smaller wheel. It might be hard to tell on camera. Or am I completely wrong? No, oh, I put the same two wheels next to each other. Silly, silly. Look, now you can see the difference. Aha! So, you have a bigger wheel that can go in the back and the, or the smaller wheel in the front. And really, you can configure it however you want. That's the great thing about these new toys. And you have, oh, a spoiler on the back. You have another little extra part here, which goes on the side. I think there should be two of these, if I can find the second one around here somewhere. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Here's one. And, haha, -ha, there you go. There should be two of these. So this has two of them, and then one here. There's one here. Let me turn it around. There's another one right there. So it has two of those. All right? And of course, you have the main character, Rusty. Hey, I'm Rusty. Ready to combine it and design it. Well, are you? I guess. Sure. All right. All right. Well, let's see what they look like when you do combine it. And it has the great thing is that these cars on the back have, uh, you know, a basic idea of how you can combine it. But again, um, you can take these things apart and you can kind of do these various things. Now, it also comes with a nice set of instructions so you can see what parts you should have in case you're missing any. And it comes with a great diagram of how to assemble it. All right. So we're gonna combine it? Yeah, why not, man? Let's do it, let's do this. All right, let's, let's do, go with the instructions. Bam, so you have the cart, the spoiler goes on the back, boom, snaps right in there. Then you have the big wheel, put that in the back. You have another big wheel. Then you have the two smaller wheels. All right, so it looks like he's ready to go. Then of course you got the engine block, which goes right on the back. Let's flip this over. You see the little blue uh, connection, so you just put that right in there. All right, and now you put in Rusty. And his feet go right into there. And look at that. He's ready to rock. Look at that. You combined it and designed it. All done. All right, so Rusty's gonna sit over there, hang out. And of course, we have Ruby, who has a very similar car. Now hers is a buggy build. And again, it comes with very similar parts. It comes with the frame, which is actually very similar in color to the larger, which look very similar in color to the really small uh, car that doesn't come apart. And I'll show you Rusty is essentially the same. So the designs are very similar, but again, with this, you can't take them apart. With this one, you can uh, put it together yourself. So again, we're gonna put it together right here on camera, but I'm gonna uh, show you all the parts. So you get the main frame, you get four wheels, remember two in the kind of larger size, and then two in the smaller size. It's like a little mini garage you got going here. Oh, wait till we get to the lab. That's gonna be amazing. So you have a little fan that goes on the back because dune buggies usually have a little fan on the back that can help uh, with the wind and push it through the sand. Oh, that's why they have those. 
those. And then you have this little, or these little steps on the side. So you have one on that side, and then another one on this side, which again is um, what comes out of the package, and you can just put it on very easily like this, um, like that. And I'll put that down. And again, you have, of course, a nice little power block in the back. And you have Ruby. I'm Ruby, ready to rock. I don't think that's your catchphrase. Whatever, I say whatever I want. Okay, so let's combine it and design it. All right, so let's do it right here. You've got the directions right on the back, or the instructions. So I'm just gonna use this picture right here, put that in there. Now this actually came with the seat in it already. So we're gonna put the little fan on the back. We have two, again, we have the two different size wheels, however you want to configure them. I like to put the two big ones on the back. Smaller ones there and there. All right. Of course, you got the little power engine block on the back. And now we have our buggy. That is so cool. What colors you got on there? Okay, well, you have red, blue, looks like you got some gray on there as well. And the tires are black, along with some uh, nice little silver on the wheels. All right, that's a lot of colors. And they're very bright and just really nicely designed. I mean, these look like great toys. And the um, connectivity with uh, Paw Patrol is going to be great because they're around the same size. And you know what? Why not? Why don't we bring some Paw Patrol special guest stars in here? Ho -ho! Who do we have today? Look who decided to, to stop on the set. It's my good friend, Chase. Holy moly, Chase. Chase, what, what are you doing here? Well, I think Chase is here to show a size comparison. That makes a lot of sense because, I mean, his show, I mean, he's got a, they've got like a million episodes and a million tours. I'm surprised he has time to be here. Get off the camera. You're taking, you can't see Chase. He's the guest star. Oh, right, right. Sorry, Chase, Chase. So, as you can see, I have Chase here with his little tow truck and hook, which uh, can make, some good for, good, make for some good adventures. You see, they're right around the same size. They, like, are very compatible. And if you want to give her a tow or give uh, Rusty a tow, it would work out really well. So uh, I just want to put these on here so you can see a nice size comparison. They're actually right in scale and perfect. And, oh, one or two other things. Bye-bye, Chase. See you later. <laughs> you also have... Uh, this additional spoiler which can go on the back so you just have to take it out just like that they pop they pop out pretty easily they there's a little bit of a um, give but as you can see it popped it out. I was able to pop it out uh, without too much uh, strain but they're meant to be kind of um, combined and recombined and all that kind of stuff now he mr. rusty himself the sport front actually pops off so if you want to replace that, Rusty actually comes with a drill that can replace the front, um, kind of the front bumper. So he can do some drilling features and that's pretty awesome. Yes, yes. You take pieces apart, hold, twist, and gently pull apart like this. It's important to twist while pulling to unlock the pieces. It takes some effort but this ensures the toys are durable and sturdy during play. Okay. Now they do, like as I mentioned before, they are pretty snug. Um, that way they can stay uh, together nicely and uh, why don't you move the camera back so I can be in the frame? I, I said back! <laughs> Slightly better, okay. So, well, this has been an amazing review. Oh my goodness, so many toys, and there are more, there are more to go, aren't there? Yes, there are a lot. It's just a lot to go through. Yeah, man, well, you got to maybe get a ne another set of hands or something. I'm not sure why you're using one hand sometimes and two hands. I really need an explanation. Again, I don't want to get into it with you. All right, all right, I'll just take your word for it. Anyway, well, thank you for being here. Um, please come back in a, in a day or two or sooner when we have um, more reviews. Oh, subscribe, 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 subscribe! I need you to subscribe because if you don't subscribe, how will you know when you get the videos or when I have the new things to show you? I'm really interested in your opinions, so please leave some comments. Um, subscribe if I didn't tell you before. Subscribe!
Okay? And be sure to come back and the credits are rolling so I have to go. But thank you very much for being here. I hope you like Rusty. We're gonna play some more and we're gonna learn and we're gonna play and do all kinds of things. Bye-bye!